Before you do anything else with Auto Tenant, you'll need to record and upload your message. Uh, you can use our callback feature or for professional high quality audio, uh, the media upload. So I'm setting the audio attendant to catch calls uh, from the primary incoming number. By selecting connect, your number is normal. I'm instructing the auto attendant to post dial the next function after it completes its welcome message, uh, which in this example will be the call queue as the next feature in the priority list. And finally, because I don't want to hold customers indefinitely in the queue, I've set the queue timeout to 60 seconds. Uh, which is going to post dial a voicemail because voicemail is enabled. Now a trick here is to set the voicemail queue also to 60 seconds, which is going to cause the voicemail to jump in at the exact moment the queue times out. And recapping, the auto tenant plays the welcome message and then post dials the call queue and finally goes to voicemail at the exact moment the queue kicks in. Now once you start building any call flows, my best advice is to keep this priority list close at hand, building up your call flows step by step and testing each one of those steps as you go.